Yes. <laughs> you know, this impatient, the quality of being impatient. Yeah. <laughs> Unwilling to wait or tolerate delay, expressing or caused by irritation. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I was thinking that um, the United States of America <laughs> is uh, giving an incentive to refuse to enforce the laws. <laughs> It's called employment. Pooh. Now, yesterday I sent an email. Yes. Uh -huh. Documenting exploitation of children. Yes. Kidnapping. Ooh. And for some reason, the thought was, well, we just can't enforce the laws. Mm -hmm. Now, um, this idea of misconduct in public office. Yes. I'm not necessarily talking about the president of the United States. I'm talking about those that are in public office. Mm -hmm. You know, I've done some reading on impeachment. Let's say you were elected to office. Yes. And you've sworn that you would support and defend the Constitution, and I've documented certain civil rights being violated. Poop. And the United States does not want to have to impeach those in office. Yes. Now, it says misconduct in public office. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Well, you're incentivizing. Yes, you are. You're giving an incentive, yes, to refuse to enforce the law when you allow for the employment of any person in public office to continue to be employed uh -huh, because you refuse to enforce the laws. <laughs> now, let's say I wanted to, to give an incentive to the government. Poop. <laughs> well, there's a, what just think about it for just a second. <laughs> you said you could use forgery and fraud. Now, I know that you think that me being impatient is unjustifiable. Yes. There's no reason for me to be impatient for you to remove your fraud. Yes. But I would say that I could uh, sue for the impeachment, yes, of every oath of office in the United States of America. <laughs> See, these sworn oaths of office, they have been uh, led to believe, yes, they've received an incentive to believe, yes, that as long as we refuse, mm -hmm, we will continue in the employment of our public office, even though we can be charged with misconduct. Poop. Mm -hmm. Now, um, let's look at it for just a second. <laughs> we'll take it down to the local level. Yes. Give me the GPS location of every outlet in this house. Yes. Mm -hmm. Because the public utility district. Yes. Yes that sells the electricity ooch, that you've been sowing into the population. Oh, so you could be on them. <laughs> I'd like to know the incentives of every county of the United States of America, pooch, where it says, yes, I could actually receive an incentive to reduce mm -hmm, my use of electricity. Yes, water, ooch. <laughs> now, as a sheriff, mm -hmm, I would say that I can sue all of the municipal electricity producers, yes, that offer rebates and incentives right now. Now, I know there's no use in me telling the sheriff's department that you have to enforce the law because you've refused for the last three and a half years. In your minds, we do not have to enforce the rights of American citizens. <laughs> well, maybe you don't, mm -hmm. but I think I have the right to sue every public utility district, yes, and all municipal electricity producers right now. <laughs> every city of Seattle, ooch, why don't we get the electricity use of the United States of America? <laughs> now, that would go for you, California. Poop! <laughs> Let's say that you are the PEG, yes, public employees. You know, why don't you get me the actual electricity producers in each and every state? Yes, each county, ooch, each city. Right now! <laughs> now, my thought is, ooch, when nations are providing incentives, yes, to reduce or uh, produce electricity, green technology, mm -hmm. for solar panels, windmills, oh. for putting, uh, oh, well, I'm going to be suing today. <laughs> now, there was the possibility that during the static Homeland Security, let's go here, mm -hmm, that you could have put the roaming of a cell phone through the electric grid, yes, and then the electromagnetic frequencies of the outlets, yes, would actually broadcast the roaming of the cell phone tower. Shut up. Now, my thought is, 
when we go through the GPS location of every outlet and every residence of the United Motherfucking States today, yeah, we are. That's right. Yes, we are. 